Cheetahs are playing. <laughs> Elephants taking mud baths. Warthogs jumping around like popcorn. <laughs> and the perfect way to end our mountain biking creature adventure is with a camp out. Yeah, tonight we're camping here in Animal Junction. Do you want to camp with us? Great! Time to set up the tent. <laughs> Let's call Zabu. He loves camping out. Zabu, Mafu! Zabu! Zabu! Zabu, Mafu! Come here, Zabu! Where is he? Zabu! Where's Zabu? We've been calling him forever. I don't know. Do you see Zabu anywhere? Where is he? Chris, look up! Hey, buddy! You are one sneaky lemur, Zabu. <laughs> I'll get Zabu a snack. Woo! Woo yeah, whoa, one-handed. <laughs> You're a strong lemur, Zabu. Oh, yeah, a perfect lemur snack. We always have great snacks in Animal Junction. Zabu, I've got sweet potatoes. Zabu loves sweet potatoes. Don't you, Zabu? Excuse me. Zabu Mafu! I can't believe my mind. Whoa, this is great. What is it? It's a tent, Zabu, for sleeping in. Oh. And we're camping out in Animal Junction tonight. Are you in? Yeah, yeah, way in. But that's not what my mind is surprised at. What are you surprised at, Zabu? Oh, I saw the most Mangatsika animal just up there. He was sleeping, and he woke up when I jumped on him. Who could it be? Who could it be? <laughs> this animal who I did see. Can you help me guess this mystery? The tail was long, black, and thick. Well, it could move around like a snake, and it even grabbed onto branches. <laughs> who could it be? This animal who I did see. She was sleeping in the daytime. I woke her up. Who could it be? This animal who I did see. Can you help me guess this mystery? A black furred, grabby tailed day sleeper. Do you know who she is? Okay, let's see. She has furry black hair with gold on the tips. Walks on four legs and loves to climb trees. A long, thick tail that's really strong. It can't be. You think so? Yes, she's a binturong. Mystery animal is here. Binturong? I've been to the forest and I've been to the desert, but I've never been to wrong. <laughs> Where's wrong? <laughs> no, not binturong is a place, Abu. This is a binturong. 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 What a Mangatsika name. For an incredible creature. Hi. <laughs> she likes you, Zab. She's sniffing me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she wants to explore Animal Junction. Come on. Let's... You want to follow her? Sure. Let's go. 
There's a lot of great stuff around here, Vinterong. Well, make yourself at home. Yeah, that's the pond. It's a little cold. Hey, now she wants to climb. Manga Zika, look at her. She's a climber. Nobody knows very much about Binturongs because there aren't very many around. Because they live deep in the forest. And because they're nocturnal. That means they sleep all day and come out at night. Nocturnal, sleep all day, come out at night. So she's not used to being up when the sun's out. Sorry for waking you up, Binturong. We better help her get back to sleep. All right, let's start by finding her a nice, quiet place. Let's see, where can she sleep? Well, maybe the Binturong can sleep in there. Let's take a look inside. First, we'll need our headlamps. Headlamp? Okie dokie. How does this help you see in the dark? Zabu, that's not a headlamp. <laughs> that's a lampshade. Hmm. These are headlamps, and they're great for looking inside caves. Somebody's already sleeping in here, Zob. More nocturnal creatures. Bats. Ghost bats. Like most bats, they find dark, quiet places like caves to sleep in during the day. Any luck in there? Shh. Bats are sleeping. They're nocturnal. Sorry, Zob. Come on, let's see if we can find you a place to sleep. Maybe Binturong can sleep in the hole in this tree. Take a look inside, Zob. Hmm? Hey! It's flying squirrel babies. They're sleeping in there. Yeah, flying squirrels are nocturnal, too. Besides, this hole is way too small for a Binturong. Shh! Flying squirrels sleeping. Hey, Martin. <laughs> I think she's found a place. Binturongs are heavy creatures. And, uh, you know, I think we better find you a different place to sleep, because this won't work. <laughs> here, how about over here? Let me try this. There you go. Let's keep looking. Another nocturnal creature fast asleep. It's a kinkajou. Kinkajou spends the night eating fruit and the day sleeping in the trees. <laughs> All the sleeping spots are taken! Manga, Zika, everybody's asleep in Animal Junction. I never knew so many creatures were asleep while we're awake. Oh, yeah, Zabu. <gasps> Lots of animals come out at night instead of during the day. Like bats. At night, they leave their caves and fly off looking for food. And flying squirrels. They leave their tree holes at night and glide from tree to tree, searching for nuts. But guys, it's getting dark out. We better hurry up if this Bintrong's gonna get any sleep before dark. Hmm, maybe Bintrong can sleep up here. Yeah, that's where Bintrong likes to sleep. She doesn't sleep in holes or caves, she just curls up in the treetops. Like me. But Bintrong isn't curling up and sleeping. Bintrong is climbing. Maybe she just wants to climb around a little bit before she goes to sleep. Binturongs are excellent climbers. Oh, sharp claws, really dig into the tree bark. That way, a binturong doesn't slip or fall. But the real thing that helps a binturong climb through the trees is her tail. Her tail can grab onto things like a hand. When a binturong is moving through the trees, her tail is always grabbing onto branches. That way, if she slips, her tail can Whoa, grab uh -oh. I smell mud. Hey, prehensile tails really work. Good thing I had my rope tail. Let's climb like a Bintron. You can do it. <laughs> I love to climb. <laughs> Chris, you're way up there. How can we get this big trunk to sleep? Hmm, I know how. Maybe she just needs a snack before bedtime. Binturong to eat lots of different kinds of food. Eggs, leaves, fish, insects. But the kind of food they like the best is fruit. 
Okay, so we have pineapples, bananas, apples, grapes, plums, kiwis. Take your pick. Pineapples! pineapples. The Binturong likes pineapple best. Yeah, me too. Let's see if we can break into this one. Look at that. Look at that tongue go. Hey, what about kiwis? I don't know, Zob, let's see. She doesn't seem to like kiwi. She still likes the pineapples the best. Wait a second. Going for the plums? Yes, plums. Second course, plums. If you want to eat like a bintrong, hold your chin high in the air. Grapes? Huh. She's finished. Okay, bintrong, time to go to sleep. Bintrong's still not going to sleep. Can you believe that? I always get sleepy after a snack. <laughs> well, maybe she'll fall asleep if we watch a movie. Daymare on Oak Street. I love this movie. I just hope it's not too scary for the Bintro. Who knows, maybe she likes scary movies. I thought you guys said this was scary. It is, Zob, keep watching. It's all bright and sunny. This is not a scary movie. Maybe not for you, Zabu, but what if you were a nocturnal creature? Whoa! I guess you're right. Daytime is as scary for Binturong as nighttime is for me. Hey, Chris, pass me the popcorn. Popcorn? I don't have any popcorn. Me neither. What's popcorn? I smell popcorn. Mm, me too. Mm. Smells like it's coming from over there. All I smell is Binturong. Of course, Zabu. Binturong smell like popcorn. What does popcorn smell like? I'll be right back, Zab. Okay, Chris. With the answer. Now, Zab, <gasps> close your eyes. Oh, okay. My eyes are closed. Hey, no peeking, Zabu. Peeking. I mean, now, the lights. Zab, see if you can find the Binturong by smelling. Oh, okay. First, smell here. Um, I'm smelling. Okay. Okay, now smell over here. Oh, oh, oh this is easy. Which is the bintrong and which is the popcorn? Oh, this is easy. This is the popcorn and, uh, uh, oh, yes, that's the bintrong. <laughs> okay, now take a look, Simon. <gasps> this is the bintrong and that's the popcorn. I got all mixed up. <laughs> you do smell like popcorn. Hey, we should call her popcorn. <laughs> Great name, Zabu. Mm. Okay, and listen, popcorn, you should be sleeping because mm. soon you and all the nocturnal creatures have to wake up. Uh oh. Too late. The moon's out. It's already nighttime. That's what time it is now. Time for the day creatures to go to sleep and the night creatures to wake up. It's wake up time for night creatures. They're on the move. Yeah, and our pal Bintrong's raring to go. Even though she didn't sleep all day. I hope she's not tired for the night. I don't think she minds losing a little sleep, Zob. She had fun. Good, because I had fun too. And you know what? what? I'm feeling Binturongish. I feel different, not the same. This kind of feeling I can't explain. There's only one thing that I can do. I feel Binturongish. How about you? Binturongish. I feel Binturongish. Binta, binta, Binturongish. I've been up all night. I'm a Binturong. Binturongish. Hey, Chris. Hey, Zob, look. Huh? Popcorn smells something. What could it be? Serval kittens. Binturongs have great senses. They use their nose to help them find fruit in the dark. Oh, that reminds me of Sensit. He had good senses too. <laughs> I was leaping along. Leap, 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 
leap when I bumped into Sense It. Oh! <laughs> he was very excited. Oh, Zabu, Zabu! Nah, I really want to test my senses. Nah, my smelling, my feeling, my seeing. Nah, can you go hide over there so I can try and find you? Oh, sure, nah, Sense It. On. One, two, nah, three. And I knew exactly how I was going to hide. I hopped over to a striped fruit tree and I ate striped fruit. And then I turned stripey and camouflaged into the striped tree. <laughs> I don't think even Sense It can see me here. Say <laughs> Zabu! I can smell you, but I can't see you. <laughs> you hear? I'm over here. Oh wow, what senses! My ears are so super, they can even hear a striped tree talking. <laughs> it's not the striped tree talking, it's me! Zabu with stripes! Sense It thought my joke was so funny that he laughed for the rest of the day. The end. <laughs> that was a great story, Zob. Hey, guys, hmm? Bintrong's taken off. Oh, maybe she smells some fruit in the forest. Bye, popcorn! Oh, now it's bedtime for day, creatures. <laughs> Even though you might not want to go to sleep. Camping out in Animal Junction's great, isn't it, Zob? <laughs> it's too late, Chris. He's already asleep. Stop. You're talking in your sleep. What's that noise? I'll never get to sleep with that noise. What could it be? I know who made that noise. Duck. Uh, the duck. Great horn owl. I gotta see this. <gasps> yeah. What an incredible night creature. Check out those eyes. This place probably doesn't even look dark to this great horned owl. Hey, Chris, what's going on? <laughs> ah! Having eyes like an owl would be great for getting up at night. I love the way that his head swivels around so those eyes can see in any direction. <gasps> Look at this. A message from Jackie. Sometimes on the weekend, my parents let me stay up late so I can watch the night creatures. Raccoons usually sleep during the day, like a lot of creatures. They're playing with my mom's furniture. They were so cute. <laughs> I almost never get to see these guys during the day. Isn't it great? There's a whole different creature world at night. Wouldn't it be great to be a night creature sometimes? Jackie's right. It would be great to be a night creature. Let's do it. Let's go prowl with the night creature. I like it. And maybe we'll figure out who is making that noise. That is a weird sound. And there's no stopping us now. We're going on a trip. Yeah. We're going to the closet. They're going on a trip. They're going to the closet to get their stuff and split. Chris, we have our headlamps, so we don't need anything from the closet. Great, let's just head for the door. But where's the door? Aha! Here it is. <laughs> Wrong door. This is the closet. <laughs> Let's head the other way. They're going on a cool adventure and they don't know what's in store. They're coming from the closet, then they're headed out the door. Believe it or not, more creatures are active at night than during the day, and each makes a special sound. One of these creatures is keeping me awake. Do you want to find out who it is? All right! Well, it isn't going to be easy finding one sound, because the night is full of sounds being made by all sorts of incredible night creatures. <laughs> Let's see some <laughs> night creatures. There's a Janet. Jackal, 12 o'clock. A hippopotamus.
goodness. <laughs> Let's go, Chris. All right. Mm. Hear that? Mm. Oh, mm. Wow. And her cup. <laughs> the mom looks pretty worn out from hunting, but that cub just wants to play. <laughs> You know how it is when your parents are too tired to play. The same thing happens to leopards. You know, this nocturnal living is making me a little hungry. I'm gonna head back to the Jeep and have a snack. All right. Where do you think that sound's coming from? There's who's making that sound. Lions! Nighttime is the right time for lions. In the daytime, a lion's eyesight is about the same as ours. But at night, a lion can see six times better than we can. Another growling sound. And that one isn't a lion. That's the sound that's keeping me awake. <laughs> what? Martin? <laughs> I think we might have figured this out. Martin's stomach was growling. Huh? Oh, I knew I should have eaten more popcorn. Well, eat up, Martin, so that by the time we get to Animal Junction, your stomach won't be growling anymore, and we can get some sleep. All right. Yeah, nighttime is the right time to see a lot of creatures. Hey, now that's a sound I know. It's Abu. Yeah, but he's definitely not asleep. What is he doing in there? <laughs> Let's find out. Shabu? You guys, you made it back for the party. Party? Yeah, we're having a nocturnal party. Me and the nocturnal animals, like these guys. Oh, African dormice. Yeah, they're pals of mine. Oh, wow. See these big ears? Those help the dormice pick up every little sound and find their way in the dark. Over here. Here's another nocturnal friend I made. Wow, I can't believe it. A ringtail. Mm -hmm. Hi. Come here. Hey, and look at this tail. No wonder she's called a ringtail. And no wonder she's so good at moving through the night. Those huge round eyes can see anything in the dark, even a little dormouse. Yeah, she can see, smell, and hear her way through the night, making her an ultimate nocturnal creature. <laughs> Great senses, like me! A ringtail is in the same family as the kinkajou and the raccoon. She has a face a lot like a kinkajou and a ringtail a lot like a raccoon. <laughs> Always give a creature a space. It's getting close to morning. Maybe ringtail wants a snack before she goes to sleep. Oh, I'll feed her. Hey, ringtail, you want a bite? It's good, it's a banana. Huh. I can't believe my mind how great nocturnal animals are. They do lots of the same things we do. They just do it at night. <gasps> like Sense It. It was the first time I met him in Sabu Land. <laughs> I was leaping along, leap, 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 when all of a sudden someone <laughs> leapt from a zango bush. <laughs> oh, I thought, who is that scary creature? <laughs> I'm Sense It, not scary. He <laughs> heard me think. I think. People think I'm scary and a monster because I'm different and I like to do things at night. Oh. Scary? You're not scary. No. You're just nocturnal. Yeah, yeah, you're nocturnal. I'm going to stay up and do things with you tonight. So we sat and waited until night came. <laughs> <laughs> it's nighttime. Oh, boy, Zabu. <laughs> oh. So we did things that Sense It likes to do at night. Oh, we played slide down the sleeping Zaboomafuasaurus. <laughs> Yeah. Whoa. 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 So me and Sensit played all night long. And that's how I met my new friend, Sensit. And believe me, he isn't scary. Whoa. The end. Great story, Zabu. Thanks. Nocturnal animals are great, too. Maybe I'll be a nocturnal animal. Well, you better get to sleep then, Zob. It's morning now. And Ringtail is headed off to sleep for the day. Have a good sleep, buddy.
This animal is a friend of mine From the tip of his nose to his funny behind All the friends that we met today Are special in their own way We've all got different names But we're really all the same Thanks for dropping by, we're glad you came These animals are friends of mine They jump and swim, crawl, fly and climb One more thing we have to say Go make an animal friend today! sleepy snack for when I go to sleep like a nocturnal lemur? Yeah, two garbanzo beans coming up. <laughs> Good morning, Zavu. Yeah, have a great day sleep. Hi, Krat Brothers. Uh, we better get some sleep, too. We've been up all night. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. The day creatures are coming out. We can't miss the day creatures. You're right, Martin. No time to rest for a creature adventure. To the creatures! We'll see you next time. Hey, wait up! Hi, my name is Allie, and this is my cat, Maggie. She loves to purr.